watching KESQ, the desert's news leader. This is News Channel 3, live at 4. Hello, everybody. I'm Peter Dowd. Well, if you're a Firebirds fan, you may have been reliving moments like this all day today. The Hershey Bears shut out by the Coachella Valley Firebirds as they met for the first time in AHL history. Sports anchor Bailey Rodondo was there for every moment of the game. This was game one for the Calder Cup Championship. He was with the team and shot this exclusive behind the scenes video right outside the locker room. This is in the tunnel below the seats as the players took to the ice in front of a sold out arena crowd. Bailey, I mean, it was just a dominant victory by the Birds, but you say both teams are already working on strategies for game two. Peter, can this inaugural season get any better? Well, of course it can. The Firebirds will be looking to feed off this big win, and the Hershey Bears will be looking for redemption or any form of confidence as the teams match up against Saturday night. Here's what the coaches told us after a 5-0 route by the Big Bad Birds. We get the win. We get the put a puck on the wall, but uh, we can't uh, let this, the scoreboard and the success that we had in game one dictate uh, how we're going to come out in game two. They're, they're a good hockey team, and so if we play sloppy like we did tonight, it's not going to work out. Yeah, Peter, the Hershey Bears coach admits they just didn't do a good job enough last night, and the Firebirds players we talked to after the game said, they played according to their game plan. Their focus on winning not just one game, but three more in this best of seven series. Peter? Oh, wait. Okay, so it seems so far, Bailey, the team's efforts to melt the competition against Hershey are working. <laughs> so far, yes, but they are expecting a pushback from Hershey. They're here for a reason. Last night, goalie Joey Decord said they'll enjoy the victory, but today it's right back to work. Ahead at five, hear from coaches what they're doing today and what fans can expect on the ice on Saturday. Peter. All right, looking forward to it. Thanks, Bailey. We will definitely be watching. And that game Saturday night could be another sellout. You can watch from home. We're televising the game on CW. Coverage starts at 630 with the game at 7.